I will show you how to uh, create form this type of form in HTML form um, client side form in PHP client side form how to create this using web expression this now we will see first one we can here toolbox is available this toolbox is not available in web expression what we do is we can go panel and we can select this one correct or not this is my web expression software this is my web expression software so easily I can design this coding so I can drag and drop the form here clear when I drag and drop can you see here form is available so here I can drop it clear or not this is what I will do it generally you see this and all I will type student name this is called input text this is input text this is input text this is called text area this is called drop down box this is called input radio this is called input checkbox uh, this is submit button reset button hope you everyone understood this one instead of writing this one can you see instead of writing input type and all automatically it will appear so what I will do is here here I will go here input type so now I will drag and place it here input what is my text name what is my student name or student ID like this I want to do it correct or not so what I will do it here here one minute I will do it here I will design here so student name first I will type student name student name then I will uh, click it here here I will put it then I will keep it here as a student name input text can you see here input text this input text I will drag and place it here clear or not then I will give return so student ID next one is student ID student ID so here I will give student ID as water here I can give student ID again input text clear suppose we want to give the password also here available can you see password also we can give like this one text box we can give so next one is email email I can give again give the space colon and email also I can give input text drag and play everything is drag and place one single form only I create this is form property correct or not so again I will do it here here I will go area of interest clear area of interest this I will do text area so how I do text area here you can see text area is the text area so this way automatically the squirrel bar will appear so here I can go uh, choose Vilayat what is our Vilayat so this I will take then I will take drop down here can you see drop down I will put it here clear or not drop down box I can put it here. see here I can give spaces so colon and spaces I will give and next one gender gender I can type gender here and here I can put gender male and female uh, gender I can put input radio can I see here input radio then I will type uh, male here I will put input radio female female I will put it then I will put it here then I will put it here which college you study this what I will give the options here this I want to give the three college names Niswa college or whatever the college I want to give so I will give here checkbox so checkbox where it is available here you see checkbox is there checkbox input checkbox can you see this I will drag it I will give the college Niswa again on checkbox I will put it this is my checkbox can you see here I put Salala next one checkbox where is my checkbox here here I will put where is checkbox here then I will give Sinas Sinas College clear or not this way I put now I will give suppose ok button submit button we can give here you can see input submit input reset it is normal button there is one button is called advanced button that is also available but we are using here what submit button I will give submit button here submit button and then I will give space here I will give reset button for cancelling or anything I will use the reset button hope everyone understood these are buttons we are doing here you can see in web expression this is our designing part 
I want to save this file as sv2.php. Clear or not? This I will close it. Sv2, sv2.php file save as. Here most people do one mistake is by default it will come as a web page. Clear or not? But I want to save as what? PHP. So what I will do is here I will go and select PHP. That is most important. Every time don't give save. If you give save by default it will come web page. So every time do save as. There is three type of save is there. One is called save. Here you see save save all save all means more than one page save means just to save it if you just to save it here what will happen is it will save as a web page so that's why always you go by default you see web page only coming so what i want to do is every time i should go and click and then i put it php clear or not then only it becomes the php this is the way most important part in the saving so now i can see how it automatically writes the code here i go code can you see here all are available here so no need to write my uh, what uh, coding here no need to write the coding here so this is what how i can give drop down options and all that i will see correct we will see suppose i want to change the name i want to change the name for example i want to change the input text name whatever it may be i want to check so i can give here input type as text and name is called what input name name is called i can give here name or student name s yes, name like this this man again student id i can give sid where is name here student id i'll give here sid clear i think this is student id i give space that's why it's coming sid like this i can change here i can give email input name student this is my email this is my email i can give yes email like this i can give clear yeah, this way i can change the name so text area what is text area area one is there here i can give text area is nothing but area whatever it may be i can give area area here i can give and here i can give what i can give option button well, uh, option button is there option no option is available here here i can give option values also if i want to give options what is the option is coming option but your value i can select it here so option values i want to give the option values also here three buttons i want to give the option value so this way i can give the option value so each button i can give the option value and then i can give the option name this also i can give the value here so for example this is split means both coding will come and uh, design also coming here both will be available split uh, coding means coding design means designing this way i can do so this also i will do again file savers i'll do php clear or not how i add values i will show you here um, values here you can see drop down drop down i want to add three values drop down i want to add what three values here what are the three values i will apply in the uh, this one is option is maybe you can see here mm, right click right click form field properties can you see form field properties here first i will remove this one blank i don't want i want add the value what value i can choose i can add the value maybe choose the value maybe i can write and give the specify value specify the value maybe i can give here nisva this is my choice value may be 10 if i selected it will come selected not selected means okay if i give okay can you see nisva is available can we see the code here what is coming value is 10 nisva is available Select or not this is what available here so select one select one this is a select name this way it's coming option button name is coming here so the option value is there whatever it may be i can select here as a option value so here i can go here design again i want to save another value how i do form field property same method add can you see add i can ins uh, include the value called sur specify the value i will include the value as 2 20 sorry 20 not selected by default uh, always uh, first value if you want to give selected that value will be selected select modify i can select that also i can do it add another value uh, another value is called uh, sinas 
the value is specify the value i want to add the specify the value see now so also by default whatever name is coming that is coming so okay okay here correct i will add three values here clear or not i'll add the three values here three options are here can you see three options i included clear or not this is select one this is way it is available here select one the same way radio i can give the value radio each one i can give the input value here the gender radio i can give here can you see here radio can you see gender gender input radio checked radio one checked means here you can see whatever is there this is called checked clear or not this is called checked that's why it's coming checked one thing is checked by default it is checked is coming and then uh, name is called radio one suppose if you want to give radio as a water some other thing we can give the radio also so here i can give two radios are the radio one radio one group name collect on one input type input name i given suppose i want to change the name so what i can give change the name i can give the change the name i can give gender gender or radio whatever it may be here i can use the name as what gender both i will use gender correct both i can give the value so suppose value i want to give i can type value otherwise i can do one thing here i can go same form field properties here you can see gender is a group name value i want to give here i will give values what m capital m for male correct already you see selected is coming can you see selected selected means this is i want to change here i can go form field property gender is my group name f capital f is my not selected because it is not selected so i give okay clear this way also i can do it so female is there and check box the same method check box i can give the value here check box name same value i can give and i can give the value maybe here i can say uh, niswa value so here form field properties you can see check box one i can give every name name is nothing but um i can give cid whatever it may be i can give here cid my name is cid so um, college id maybe i can say college value is nct niswa means nct not selected okay if i give checked means selected can you see checked means it is selected is coming so here i say form field properties here i say same thing cid then i will give here cid i think normal cid not capital letter cid cid here i will give here value is called what salala so i can see sct all are capital i given here i can give same thing form field property cid college id i can give the value sinas so h h id sct this is what my value now i can see in the coding can you see here the check box everything is cid correct the whatever the name i given cid here i say checked one thing extra is coming because here i did check clear that's why it's coming so if you wa don't want to remove this also no need if you want to remove i want to remove remove this one otherwise go here form field property make it as not checked clear that's all over that case what will happen here it won't come checked or not information is not coming so this way i can do the shinas value also so submit i give the name as submit one s yes, is capital submit one reset one is a name this what i did so now i want to save it save as always do save as php select this one so this is a method those who are very new to this web expression concept that people i am explaining how to design in web expression one client side form that is what this tutorial